Let's see how the Bugs 2 B2C goes. So we need to turn on the TX transmitter. Turn on the quad. Okay. Let's do compass calibration. One, two, three, and vertical, one, two, three, what are the lights doing? Okay, solid green lights at the back, solid red lights in the front after compass calibration. Do gyro calibration, pull the base sticks down to the left and release and press. Let's start video. That's a picture. Video started, auto takeoff. Start the motors. Try auto takeoff. There we go, that's auto takeoff. Okay, drifting a bit to the right, but holding steady, just being pushed across by the wind. Okay, let's take it up. Okay, you can see the lights quite brightly and clearly. So green lights on the back, red lights on the front. Let's turn it into the wind. Okay, going up nicely. Bring it forward. Okay, let's do a pan. Nice slow pan. Got 16 satellites. around into the sun a bit. Flying nicely. Okay, holding altitude very well.
going very smoothly. on the altitude and I'm gonna bring it down a bit now See the lights still solid. I've been going six minutes. Holding really nicely. to speed okay so this is full pitch forward quite fast too actually for a GPS quadcopter does only have the single speed it flies very well See if we can get a little bit more video of the reservoir there. Just pushing it from behind, bring it around again. Very stable, very steady, flying very well. We've been going eight minutes.
today is just go up into the sun and see what it's going to do to the video. Okay, bring it back this way again. Does really go quite fast for a quadcopter GPS. Bring it down and get a bit closer now. Very steady. Very stable. Oh, solid lights, looking good. Sounds really nice, very smooth. See the blue light blinking at the bottom taking video and see the video being taken on the screen here too. Got 18 satellites. It's really holding well apart from the wind. Okay, we're on the, over 11 minutes here now. Okay, just going to let it drift. No, it's just the wind that's taking it. Otherwise, holding altitude really nicely. Hope the video has come out nicely. Around 12 and a half minutes. I'm going to take it to about 14 minutes and then test the return to home. Light's still solid, all going well. Let's try a bit of a punch out and see what happens. Okay. Okay, that's a punch out. Not bad. Still quite fast. Okay, now I'm getting a low warning. Okay, I'm going to press return to home. 
Alright. Moving across, moving back. Coming overhead. Okay, we're on 14 minutes. It's descending slowly. And that's it landed within a meter of where it took off. They'll turn the TX off. I hope the video is saved because I turned the TX off without turning the video off first. So yes, a really great flight, very stable, holds well. Just drifts in the wind, really maintains altitude, can see the lights quite clearly, the return to home functioned very well, not very fast on the return, but you know, stable and steady. Oh, a really great GPS quadcopter for the price. And I hope the video came out nicely. Thanks for joining me. Cheerio.